I'm Mo Stax. I shoot music videos for hip hop artists in LA and Las Vegas. And I started making better music videos by doing these five things. Number one, develop a concept, theme, or storyline. Whether that theme is zombies, mafia, or 70s fashion, the best music videos are themed. Videos without a theme typically get less than 30 seconds of play from me, unless I really, really, really like the song. Give me a story, give me something cool to look at, give me something to think about, give me something to remember. Number two, costumes or dynamic clothing. Hip hop artists are notorious for carefully crafting their images, so it can be hard for them to reach outside of their comfort zones. But a dynamic outfit or costume can take your video from one that is forgotten to one that stands out from the rest. If you are going to splurge on anything, splurge on outfits and costumes. It will be the most affordable thing to splurge on, but will add the most to your video. Number three, shoot your video in 4K or Ultra HD at a minimum. The new standard for film and music videos is Ultra HD or 4K and up. YouTube currently streams in Ultra HD and many people are watching your videos on their HD TVs. IG still streams at 1080p and less, but you don't want a low res video if your content is being consumed on a viewer's TV. As an example, my Caves music video received about 40,000 YouTube streams about 44% of those views came from TV screens, and viewers watching on TV were more likely to watch the entire music video. Number four, camera movement over special effects. For my personal taste, I prefer camera movement over a bunch of effects and cuts. Sometimes a song demands a fast pace, but in my opinion, some videographers go overboard with special effects and cuts. However, if you do not have a camera stabilizer, a gimbal, a tripod, a slider, or don't know how to effectively shoot handheld, your video could be unbearable to watch because of camera shake. A stabilizer or a gimbal will give your video a more cinematic look if you are not experienced shooting handheld, which can be difficult if you don't know how to properly hold the camera. Number five, coloring and lighting. Does the image look flat right out of the camera? Editors usually have to do some type of color correction at a minimum to make your image pop. Does the coloring or the lighting give the video a mood? Is your song really dark or is your song very happy and bright? That may affect what colors and lighting you want to use during production and during the editing process. It's usually the concept, theme, or story and the costumes or the setting that make a good music video on a budget. If you can't spend thousands of dollars on camera equipment, lights, locations, and voluptuous talent, spend time creating a unique concept or finding crazy clothing or outfits to make your video stand out from the other million videos on YouTube. Now you should be thinking about all of these things when you shoot your video but please check out my next video if you want to avoid filming mistakes that can destroy your music video.